Man, what did I do? <laughs> That uh, didn't work very well. What's going on, YouTube fam? It has been a very, very, very long time since my last post. We uh, will not get into that. Happy 2022. Uh, I am back and ready to start banging out some videos for you guys. I'm talking like bang out some videos for you guys, for reals. Uh, today, we're gonna start out. I'm out here on the north coast of Oregon and I'm uh, planning on doing some surf perch fishing. And uh, I was actually hoping to do some clamming this morning, but the tides are uh, a little wonky and not what I thought they were going to be. So it sounds like tonight will actually be a uh, negative low tide. So I've got a new clam gun. Hopefully get out here and find some razor clams. It's something I have not been able to do uh, on video yet. But I'm going to show you guys what it is I'm using really quick. And then we're going to get out here and see if we can't get on some fish. So you guys have seen this before if you've watched my videos for a day or two. This is my uh, 12 foot Akuma Rockaway, uh, 10 to 20 pound line and three quarter ounce to three ounce uh, lure weight on there. And I've got that, Pat, <laughs> and I've got that matched up with a uh, Akuma Samar C55. So plenty of uh, line capacity on there. And then today we're just gonna be floating the, uh, the high-low rig, throwing the high-low rig. Uh, we've got some of our uh, Berkeley Gulp sandworms on there we've got which is probably rather familiar to a lot of you guys is that uh notorious camo and then uh i was i might use them i'm not too sure if i'm going to use them we'll see how the camo does but we've also got some of those those blood red ones right there too uh so no bait today uh if, had i done a little bit of clamming this morning i would probably use uh some leftover clam but uh, this is what we've got for the day, so we'll see how it works out. Let's get out here and try and get on some fish. All right, well, I'm going to refrain from saying anything about the conditions right now because any time I do, I swear it always changes. But I'm just going to try and fish each of these sets of waves here and uh, see if we can't find us a friggin' surf perch. Should be our very first surfers. There we go. That is a nice fish. All right, well, we did get our first surfer, which isn't uh, a huge one, but it is one in the bucket. It's a place to start, so we're gonna get out there and see if we uh, can't get some more. Big surf perch.
my weight moving in? I forgot a little fish on there. It is another tiny, tiny fish. Oh. Man, well, we're finding, finding some fish, but it's all these, these little guys. There's gotta be some bigger ones out here somewhere. Feels like a good one too. Oh, stay on. Well, it felt like a good one. All that current. Can I have a little? Oh, you know dude, it's gonna be a good fish. That is gonna be a really good fish. It's probably gonna be our biggest surf perch yet. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We just keep that thing on there. That's a good one. I couldn't be uh, any happier get out here and finally start catching some fish again. Going into the bucket. That's about as big as the first one we got. First good size. That's still lively. Let's throw a camo on that bottom one too. So they were hitting on the red. But now come back to the camo. probably one of the biggest downers of doing this especially when your hands get numb like this is trying to uh, thread these worms on there and they can already be a pain in the butt but then not being able to feel half your friggin hand and fingers it really sucks see if we can't add to these guys down there They all seem to. I guess some feel big and then they'll be smaller. It feels super small and then turns into a huge fish. But, but ooh, I don't know. What do I want to do with you? We're going to keep you too. Alright. Well, we got four in there. Oh man, this is my magic place absolutely love the ocean love it love it love it ah, don't love that that's weird there we go oh yeah yeah i think it's 
a small one. I'm gonna leave them on there for a second, see if we can get that other hook. We'll get a double. Bring it in, see what we got. She's surfing the surf. Oof. All right, you get to go back and hit our top one. It's uh, a little small. All right. All right, little buddy. There you go. Get out of here. It'll be a good time. better than actually catching fish out here they don't have to be the biggest fish but I mean I really like not just throwing oh look at that it was a double got us a double Woo! you guys know how to double a big fish all right there goes you get your buddy oh you ate it you ate it oh there you go you're lucky you're a lucky day bud Alright, our first double, but just some little fish. So we're gonna let those guys go. I was trying to do this so uh, the wind isn't killing the sound here, but there it is. That surf perch. That thing is a uh, toad. another small one just another little one boom back somebody out there go there we go thought it felt a tap back but a fishy just said, as long as they're uh, biting I'm happy all right no free meal for you buddy but here's a free ride Whoop.
it's another little double. Did we just lose the other one? It was a double. It was a double. <laughs> oh, I could see the other one flapping and then it popped off right at the end. Oh, sorry, bud. There we go. That one is, I mean, it's a keeper size, but I really am trying to find some slightly bigger ones out here. Feeling pretty good. Might as well. I'm gonna keep fishing for a bit here. There we go. There's a fish. Keep that one. That's a good size one too. Alright. Oh goodness. Ooh! That is another good one. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Too small, bud. I'll let you go too. In the corner of the mouth. There you go. There you go. It took it really hard, so I'm curious to see the size of this fish. That's another keeper. Keep that one. Ah. What's going on? Oh, it's on there. It was just swimming towards me, dragging the weight. Quick as uh, that bite turned on today, it has definitely slowed down. <laughs> so I think I'm gonna go get these uh, fish put away and uh, start getting uh, ready for some clamming. So here is our haul of uh, fish for the day. We ended up with uh, seven on their total. And probably this guy here being uh, one of the bigger ones. But uh, I, I gotta be uh, thankful just to be able to uh, come out here today and be able to get some on the line and uh, be able to take something home to eat. Oh, into the new cooler. Actually, you know what? No, that'll make these all slimy. Just throw it in with the bait. Beautiful sunset going on out there. Got some clamors, I'm sure. Today was a, let's say, successful and uh, fun day. As always, I appreciate you tuning in with the adventure. Uh, I think I'm going to get some warm clothes on. I'm going to hook up with this uh, guy, Mike, over here that I met today, and uh, we're going to go out and do some razor clamming. So, 
stay tuned. Hopefully, uh, next video will be uh, some razor clam. Thanks for watching, guys. Until next time, best of luck to you.